Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. Guess what? We're going to be doing a bleach bath today. So there you see I have my measuring cup. I'm actually going to start measuring out some water for the bleach bath. Now I'm going to add 16 cups of water, which equals to one gallon. So again, that's 16 cups of hot water, the hottest water that your tap will allow. Keep pouring it in. Okay, so now I've got my bleach and I'm going to add for this gallon of water, um, which is 16 cups, I'm going to add in a quarter cup of bleach. Um, I'm going to add a little extra, but it's one gallon to quarter cup of bleach. So as you can see there, it's a little bit more than a quarter cup. So here's my hair. Um, this was hair from a friend of mine. She bought from somewhere, I'm not sure where, but it was giving her a lot of trouble. A lot of tangling, a lot of matting and whatnot. So she asked if I can fix it for her. So this is what I'm doing. So anyways, I submerged the hair into the water which is the bleach and water mix. The water is hot. Now at this point you might see bubbles um, start coming up and that's normal. So anyways, in my second basin, I'm going to start filling up some water with some shampoo in the meantime while the hair sits. So there you go, you see that I'm kind of dipping the hair in and out of the bleach solution and combing out at the same time. You really shouldn't let your hair sit in the bleach water for more than three minutes. Um, as I said, you'll see some bubbles start to arise. That's normal. Um, that's just what happens. So keep dipping in and out, keep checking it, keep combing it. And again, a maximum of three minutes. So do you remember that basin that we had filled with water? It had lukewarm water in it and it had the shampoo solution. So I'm gonna go ahead and now dump out the bleach water, give the hair a little bit of a good rinse. And the basin that we had prepared with the shampoo and water, I've now dipped the hair and I'm dipping in and out, uh, making sure that I'm getting all the bleach out of the hair. So I'm now going to wash the basin, basin that had the bleach and water solution because it's very important that you clean the basin before you add the ammonia. Very, very important. You do not want to mix those two solutions. So now that the hair is rinsed out, I'm going to rinse it a little bit with some more water because I want to get all the bleach out. I'm going to go ahead and start working on the solution for the second part of this, which is the ammonia. So now I'm actually putting about 12 cups of water and for every three cups you're going to add a quarter cup of ammonia so because I use 12 I'm going to use four quarter cups of ammonia now don't let the hair sit just keep dipping it in and out in and out pass a comb through it in and out um, you don't want to do this too much um, there I have a basin that has water in it and I'm rinsing out the ammonia from the hair I've used a little bit of shampoo as well So I'm going to go ahead and use a anti-residue shampoo, a clarifying shampoo to wash the hair really, really good. I'm probably going to do this about two times. I'm not rubbing the hair or anything like that, just running the shampoo through it and rinsing it off with lukewarm water. So I've actually um, put some conditioner on the hair. I've used the bamboo treatment. I'm going to be putting it inside of the microwave. I put it in a plastic bag and put it in the microwave for one minute and 30 seconds. Um, let that sit in there. It's gonna give it a nice deep condition. 
once the hair the microwave is finished and you take the hair out rinse the hair with cold water okay that's the best thing for it so cold water and you do a rinse after you've rinsed out all the conditioner and whatnot um, you know try to dry the hair as, as best as can I would recommend to actually air dry the hair so here is what the hair looks like after it's been air dried it's still a little damp but as you can see it looks so much better than it was looking before um, it has a nice sheen to it it's a little damp as you can see but I mean it's it's pretty good and I could run my fingers through it which I couldn't do to the hair before I did the bleach bath so everything's looking great thanks for watching guys make sure to subscribe comment um, share thanks so much bye now